keep them at eight minutes a piece. Okay, this this video three for the Algebra One Study Guide, Magnolia High School Spring Semester Exam. Find the perimeter of the figure, and we need to add up those sides. So three x plus two plus six x plus five x. We add those together. Three and six make nine. Nine and five make fourteen. So this is fourteen x plus two. 27, simplify the difference. When you are subtracting, you need to rewrite the problem because that negative is going to affect everything in the back. So it is negative 7x minus 5x to the fourth plus 5. And then when I distribute, that's going to be plus 7x to the fourth plus 5 plus 9x. So like terms, we're going to start right here. And that's going to give me 2x to the fourth. I don't do, oh, there they are. The regular x terms, 2x. And then the regular terms are right here. 5 and 5 make 10. Same thing this one. We need to rewrite it so we get our signs right. So the first parenthesis stays the same. 6w squared minus 7w minus 4. The second one becomes negative 2w squared, negative 3w plus 3. Now we're ready to combine like terms. 6w squared minus 2w squared is 4w squared. Negative 7w, negative 3w is negative 10w. And negative 4 plus 3 is negative 1. Now, when you're simplifying the sum, you don't have to rewrite it. All you have to do is pick out the like terms. 3u cubed plus 8u cubed is 11u cubed. 3u squared doesn't have anything that matches it. Negative 8u. 7 and 8 make 15. So that's that one. Simplify the product. You're going to use the distributive property here. and We're going to multiply as we move across. 8 times negative 3 is negative 24. P to the first times P squared is P to the third. 8P to the first times 6P to the first is 48P squared. 8P to the first times negative 2 is negative 16P. 31, we're going to multiply using FOIL. 5X times 3X is 15X squared. 5x times 6 is 30x. 3 times 3 is 9x. And 3 times 6 is 18. Usually when you do that, the numbers in the middle will combine. So when you simplify, you're going to get 15x squared plus 39x plus 18. <coughs> Number 32. Simplify the product using the distributive property. 6h squared plus 4h, plus 21h, plus 14. The two in the middle are going to combine, and that's going to be 25h plus 14. Solve the equation by factoring. The first one, z squared plus 5z minus 14 equals 0. We're going to factor that into two binomials, z and z. Factors of 14 are going to be 7 and 2. I'm going to set those equal to 0. Z plus 7 could be 0, or Z minus 2 could be 0. In the first case, Z could be negative 7. In the second case, Z could be 2. 34, we're going to factor that one. They have a common term is C. So it's C times C minus 3 equals 0. You have two options here. C could equal 0, or C minus 3 could equal 0. In that case, C would equal three. And that concludes our study guide.